listening to Rock Peter Africa. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Thank you so much for joining us this evening on the Local Rhythms Countdown. Thanks so much for having me. All right, so um, before we get to start uh, talking about your brand new mixtape, which is out, which is titled uh, Dance It Out, I just want yeah. to take you back uh, uh, to the last year or the other year when you were a Quatcher Award nominee. What was that like for you? Well, it, it was an honor for me. It was really uh, a great experience. I didn't expect it to come at that point. You know, so... Getting a call that I've nominated in the Quattro Music Awards was really just amazing. You know, like I just got the news from my friends. The guys were already aware that I'm nominated. I think I was offline that day. Really? You know, so the time I got back online, I just found the guys have already started voting for me. Oh. And yeah. So the news was already moving and, you know, people... Uh, started voting for me it was it was really an amazing experience all right so now uh fast forward to the year 2021 um a lot has been happening for you you now have um a mixtape which is titled dance it out tell me yeah. about uh dance it out and what it is all about dance it out mixtape initially is um a compilation of all my songs you know, so like most most of the songs that are on the on the mixtape were released as singles. You know, and currently I'm working on my album, and so my my team decided to say, you know, like it, I think it's been almost nine months since I released something. You know, so uh, my my last single was "Dance It Out." So it's a song that talks about uh, ladies who are in you know toxic relationships and they are not really uh, respected and, and valued, you know. So I, it was just like a reminder to say, you are beautiful and you are worth more than you think. You know, you are worth more than um, the picture this person is giving you. You know, so in as much as somebody may say, you know, I don't love you anymore, you have to know that, you know, you are beautiful and God still loves you even more than that person. So now, of that, 2021 has been a, a rough year for me. I started reflecting about my life and listening to my music. I then gave me a picture to say, you know, this song dumps it out, you know, talks about um, giving hope to the ladies, reminding them about their words. And so it, it, it's a healing song, you know, like it's a song that will help you go through a healing process if you're broken. And so me going through a series of um, ups and downs this year was just uh, a, a reflective, a, a great moment for me to just realize to say, you know what, I think this, this song, because I got back to listening to my songs and, you know, the songs were speaking to me on a, on a deeper level you know like i listened to all these songs that i put out they started speaking to me they started helping me uh, see that there's a light at the end of the tunnel so i realized that, you know I, I think i'm going to use this uh dance it out to put it as a big step title because it's going to also help a number of people get through hard situations and just help them heal so it's Initially, a healing song, a uh, mixtape. Indeed. So, um, Rock Peter Africa, the mixtape um, is a, is an eight-track mixtape, and you yeah. featured uh, various artists like Tilo and um, yeah. Chief Aiden. The yeah. name is Elsie. And yeah. um, what was it like for you as uh, working with uh, all these other artists? Well, firstly, this is a great artist. The name is LC and Chief Aiden. These guys are part of my group. So I'm also part of a group called Team Yesu. So these these guys um, have been very instrumental, you know, when it comes to, to helping me step in my work. And, you know, when we were making those songs, so like Chief Aiden is on a song called Mochaluke. I saw that Chief Aiden was the right person for that because before I get to make a song or work with somebody on a song, mostly we have these conversations and just talk about 
a whole lot of issues affecting us, you know, affecting a, a lot of people out there. And so, Duke Aiden was the right person and he really delivered to, right. to the mark. The same applies with, uh, the name is Elsie, then Tilo and is well. also, yeah, an amazing artist that I've been, you know, looking up to for quite some time. So at some point, me and him were under the same label, Guap Music, which was being run by the late Tim Dollar. And so we we have been like we've been having conversation of working on a project together, but then we didn't really just have the right song, and I, I think it wasn't like really the right time. So it took about two years for us to get into the studio oh, and wow. just work on a project. Yes. So when I had Sonica, I was just like, I think Dilo is the right person. All right. All right. Yeah. Um, Rock Peter, um, are we going to see any visuals to um, the songs that you've done for your mixtape or you're going to wait for your album um, to have visuals? We, we are actually looking at putting out visuals because I think we've had a, a lot of um, singles that have no visuals. So this time around, we want to make sure that we add the first to the music. We're going to have maybe one or two videos okay. and then we get to jump to the album okay have you set a date yet for the release of your album or that is still um in the works it, it's still in the works we haven't yet set uh, but we are like 85 percent done with the recording all right so um uh, rock peter where can people purchase uh your music from if they would like to get your music and also your socials for people to follow you and get to know more on what you're doing all right so my music on all digital platforms and just um, search for Rock Peter Africa and all these uh, digital platforms are going to appear and it's now easier for them to access my music and so also for my social handles the Facebook is Rock Peter Africa we're going to be interacting then Instagram it's the African Rock no stress just the African Rock Twitter is the African Rock also, so YouTube as well. They can subscribe to my YouTube, Rock Peter Africa. All right, and so we, yeah. um, we're going to have our power play from your mixtape, which is titled "Dance It Out." Which song are we going to listen to from um, "Dance It Out"? Let's go with "Sula Ko Ola Pepa." Sula Ko Ola Pepa. Yeah. All right, so do us the honors of introducing our next power play, Rock Peter Africa. Hello, listeners. This is uh, Rock Peter Africa, so the heart of Kopala Ndola. The song you're going to be listening to right now on power play is Tola Ko Ola Pepa. Please do enjoy. The, the Local Rhythms Countdown Power Play. Power. Team. Yes, some music. DJ Spark. On it. My name is Ashley, but you can call me Rock Peter. Africa. 